of law meuliza who is fooling who i would want to say that william ruto is fooling the government because we are the government and uh, it is so sad that someone of uh, his teacher who is holding his office can fool the electorate ningependa nianze na hii mjadala wa kwanza about gmo a lot has been said when I speak about gmo and i would want to give it a different perspective nimekuwa nikipinga hii gmo tangu isemekane na bado naipinga hapa bwana speaker and i would want to remind people of what happened to 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 sony sugar ukileta kitu from abroad like uki import it directly kills the kenyan market or rather producers wa kenya hii gmo leo hii tunaiongelea it is not like wanatuletea mbegu tulime hapa kwetu and that is to mean wanatuletea a final product na kama ni mahindi ni kusiaga tu na kukula imebaki bwana speaker and that is also to mean wakulima wa Rift Valley mali William Samoe Ruto anatoka wakulima wa Western wakulima wa Central and all other parts wa hii Kenya they will be having a competitor in the market and the competition will not be fair for two main things bwana speaker number one, e importation tunaambiwa ni tax free the moment imekuwa tax free it is going to impose a, an a unfair competition to the local producers bwana speaker na pia ukiangalia hii e importation tunaambiwa inakuja time yenye Kenya ina expect mahindi kutoka kwa shamba large scale producers wa Kenya huwa wanavuna between December ikielekea January and hii ndo time tunaambiwa tuna expect importation which is tax free for the next six months bwana speaker and that is to me ni serikali iko imejitoa ime, ime nje kukandamiza wakulima wa Kenya na kukandamiza wa Kenya na je itakandamiza wa Kenya kwa njia gani I would want to look at the social aspect ya EGMO inakuja Kenya bwana speaker Kenya ukiangalia kuna vitu tuna export ikiwemo majani chai ikiwemo mira ikiwemo so many things including flowers and you realize that inchi yenye tuna export hizi vitu bwana speaker they really don't want anything to associate with gmo and the moment kenya itakubali gmo ifike kenya they will think that we are even growing gmo and our exports are going to be denied pale inje and in long run we are going to exp- experience something yenye what we export is much lower than what we import and it is going to affect our gross domestic product and the moment that is affected bwana speaker our economy is going to come down and down so kitu yenye naweza ambia wananchi ni kwamba william samoe ruto ameamua arudishe kenya ikuwe kwa ile level ya uganda na tanzania kiuchumi na kuleta hii GMO and the only thing we can do kama wananchi ni kukata William Ruto na GMO yake if there is something hidden we are going to get from USA tukichukua hii GMO afadhali hiyo kitu pia tukatazwe bwana speaker and we need to refuse this with the strongest terms possible yenye tuko nayo bwana speaker you ya muda I would like to look at uh, the second uh, part of the debate the political marriage na ningependa nikuwe nasty kidogo when explaining this bwana speaker leo hii uki, ukioa mwanamke jua kona matako kubwa siku ile matako itapungua utakuwa na shida na ule mwanamke and that is to mean 
the political marriage between central part of Kenya and Rift Valley, it was not founded on genuine agendas and principles. And at the moment, wanaona ni kama zile features waliangalia mwanamke ikawapendeza imepungua. And now they want to withdraw. And I'm telling them, mata mki withdraw sahi, don't expect a luo to support you in that. And in that marriage ni kama kidonda imegwarwa, na mjaluo kazi yake itakuwa ya kuweka chumbi kwa hiyo kidonda. Na iwanyanyase mpaka five years ishe. So that when it comes to 2027, they can make the right decision. Wakulima hapa, si wakulima but wanamulima Kenya. They went to the ballots to fight Raila Molo Dinga, not the poverty. Walienda kupigana na Raila Molo Dinga ende bondo. Leo hii Raila ako bondo. Wanalia hapa Central Kenya. Je, walienda into a marriage kuwasaidia ama kupeleka Raila bondo. So it is a high time they know how to make right decisions. Nikienda kwa ya tatu ambayo ni ya mwisho. Yes. Is it true that you kwa Raila Molo Dinga na utoke? Then you shine. It is true bwana speaker because the, the, the political base yenye tuko nayo ile ile misingi or the foundation ya politics ya Kenya ni ile mbaya. The moment umetoka kwa Raila Molo Dinga serikali itakuwa inakutumia inakupea cheo ndio wananchi waone ni kwamba Raila Molo Dinga is a political failure. Na hawa watu wote ambao wamekuwa wakitoka kwa Raila Molo Dinga wakipewa vyeo kwa serikali ni nini wametuletea bwana speaker. So nikimalizia nasema hivi. Raila Molo Dinga ni mwenye ukifanya kazi na yeye na mmalize pamoja utakuwa na a good political future because ako na stand ya kusimamia na kupigania hii Kenya ili tupate ile vitu yenye tunafaa kupata kama wa Kenya bwana speaker asante sana